What's going on? Hope you guys are good. So, Ahsoka. We've just had new leaks come out and they are so insane, honestly. These leaks for Ahsoka just keep getting better and better. Now, there's a few leaks in this one leak, I'd say, so you can say it's more than one leak, but I'm just going to say it is one because it's basically a part of the same thing. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into it. Now, word on the street is that Thrawn is going to have an apprentice, a turned Jedi named Balin, who he basically takes under his wing, you know, just like Emperor Palpatine and Darth Vader. It's going to be kind of like that, but a bit different because, of course, Thrawn is not a Force user, well, at least at the moment, but, you know, anything can change in this new world this new galaxy called the new beyond if you want to find out more about the new beyond by the way go check out my last two videos because i'll explain it very well for you guys and let me know your opinion on it down below in them comment sections on them videos so Thrawn will team up with this new Jedi, this fallen Jedi called Balin. But that's not it, because Balin is also going to have an apprentice, which is basically the Asajj Ventress of this new universe. His apprentice is going to be a Night Sister, who's also fallen to the dark side, even though the Night Sisters are basically dark side users. Now you may be thinking, how does this all come about? Well, that was also semi-explained, because Thrawn comes across a Night Sister clan, which by the way, is actually the same clan from the other galaxy but this is where they originated. Now you know that this Night Sister clan is the same as the other one, but this is where they actually came from. So this is very interesting. And I'd like to know how they made their way over to the other galaxy, the one we know and love. But yeah, Thrawn's gonna make a deal with these Night Sisters. I think it's to share their land, basically. Just kind of like, you know, be civil and get along with each other. He can do whatever he plans to do and they can do what they do. And I guess they kind of come together, start working with each other now and then. And I say that because sources say that Thrawn will get his own walking dead army. There'll be zombies and I don't know what species they are. They probably are going to be night sisters. You know, the dead ones that we see in Fallen Order, for example, and the Clone Wars. Thrawn will either make a deal and get this army from the night sisters or he just goes somewhere in this new galaxy where it comes across something that allows him to get this walking dead army or he just comes across the walking dead army in general and recruits them, I guess, who knows? But yeah, that is so interesting because I don't know how Ezra fits into all of this. You know, is Ezra going to be good? Is he going to be bad we do not know this is very exciting this is the most exciting star wars has been since disney has taken over this franchise but yeah that's the news what do you think about it thrawn will get his own walking dead army he'll team up with this fallen jedi called balan who has a night sister apprentice which is just like a sarge ventress but of course he's going to be a bit different and she's going to be hunting ahsoka throughout the show how did i miss that jeez how did i miss saying that i'm sorry there's so much going through my head right now about this show it just sounds too good but that apprentice is going to be hunting ahsoka throughout the show while she's trying to find Ezra and of course Ezra's linked with Thrawn so really it's just a loop of people who just want to find each other and some of them want to kill each other you know it's very very interesting and it's going to make for a very entertaining show with that premise I can't see it having any boring moments at all but yeah how does this sound to you guys let me know down below and I'll see you on the next one when I have more news because I love talking to Soka you know this is going to change Star Wars forever I talk about all Star Wars of course if you want to go check out other videos go check them out you should check out the previous two especially because they have other details about these leaks and i'll go further into them separately but let me know how you feel about these leaks down below do you think they're good do you think they're bad what are your theories for this show and these leaks let me know i'd love to talk about it and i'll see you on the next one master window you are under arrest Psst. chancellor are you threatening me master jedi the senate will decide your fate i am the senate uh -huh. not yet yeah yeah oh. <laughs> <laughs> Anakin, the Jedi are taking over. I am going to end this once and for all. No, no, no. <laughs> Have the power to save the one you love. I need him. Hmm. <laughs> what have I done? Learn to use the dark side of the force. I will do whatever you. Ask. Henceforth, <laughs> you shall be known as Darth Vader.